Hello everyone, uh, today I am going to show you how to show image uh, in data grid view in Windows form. Uh, so first of all design a table uh, with the binary image uh, field. So it's easy uh, data grid image. Okay, uh, in this uh, table we have three entry or you can say the three columns that is ID name and the data and the data represent the binary uh, format of image okay his identity is true it means uh, automatically incremented uh, column is one by one okay that's fine now open uh, your EDMX uh, model and update your database if it's not there so please add entity data model designer and watch my previous video tutorial which is related to edmx file okay now after that you can add a new windows form okay and in which you can add a new data grid view data grid view okay and uh, assign the columns and the data key properties the header text of the column and how many columns are there in the data grid view so uh, define it data grid view dot auto generated column it means false i mean to say uh, design manually data grid view one dot columns column count is two and uh, the last column is related to the image and that first two column is represent to the data so columns zero dot name is uh, related to id so copy this line and paste five and six times uh, the header text is id we can say the image id and the data key property data property name is related to id okay that's fine now copy this and uh, the data property name is mandatory to related to with the uh, column name okay so the first column is represent with the name name okay now the third column is directly represent with the image so data grid view image cell image column is data grid view image column so the separate uh, column uh, is uh, there in the data grid view so data grid view image column so image column dot name is data image image column dot header text is also there and the data property name is must with the uh, server explorer uh, or you can say the database name I think I have data image image column dot header text is image show is the uh, cell value of data grid view now the image column dot image layout 
data grid view image cell layout dot scratch or you can assign the normal and zoom that is the image layout data grid view one dot columns dot insert in the po at the position of two okay data grid view one dot raw template dot height is hundred data grid view one dot columns two dot width is hundred Now after that you can bind this grid view with the database table. For the binding we have a EDMX file. So you can easily bind with uh, using the EDMX file. So I have a EDMX file with the context class that is banking DB entities 1. DB equals to new banking DB entities 1 and variable item equals to dbe dot data image data grid image dot to list and assign that and data to the data so uh, to the data grid view so data source equals to item sorry items now after that okay now add a button control when we click on the button control, open file dialog is open and get the images from your computer and store that images in the in the form of the binary binary array you can say use using open file dialog okay. String file name is uh, dialog dot file name. Bytes is the oops that file that is existing system dot io use control dot to resolve the namespace file dot read all whites and what that is the file name string I think that is enough the file name is stored in the uh, name and the bytes is actually stored in the image okay and uh, now the data grid image IMG uh, uh, make a object of uh, the table that is data grid image image dot name and assign with the path dot get file name is the file name oops resolve the local and as well as global variable issues so cut this parenthesis blocks and paste just after that okay image dot data and where is the data in the form of bytes Okay, that's fine. 
Now after that using you can bind the grid view. So call that method bind data grid view. Okay, run this uh, home load images. Oops, not getting there because the save changes is not call just after that. So just after that, you can make some changes or you can call the uh, So just copy that banking db entities dbe db dot data grid image dot add what that is img and db dot save changes that is context changes okay run it yeah but image uh, does not display data is there but image is not display first of all change the scratch as well as normal in the form of where is stretch and after that you can make uh, and after that you can check the data property name first is normal and uh, Ballness. Yeah, it is not there. So again, after that, you can check your data property name of the column image where is it's not there. So first of all, refresh it. Show image. Yeah, it's the name is the data and the code is there what yeah data image the data property name is the image of the image column you can check it so replace with the image the same name of the column is there must you can check it there is data so data property name is in data image in place of data both columns are same okay so thank you very much for watching this video